okay? Um, if you use the dishes and we use all the short down bits, I'm very happy for you to take it home with you. Okay, the design home, it's up to you. Um, you don't need loads of foam really, so I'm just sort of taking off the corners. And it's basically a compact, okay, so it's not loose open. Lots of different textures in it as well. So you might want to make it quite eastery, which is why I've got this medium here, which is called Mukumbekia. Don't ask me to spell it. <laughs> Mukumbekia. Yeah, so we've got these little dishes, foams go under. Cross over the actual <laughs> too much foam. Now you could create a base with this, this is sizal, okay, which is quite nice, which means we can, or we're going to use this Mukumbekia. It's quite a messy medium, it's really effective though. We buy it in big bags, like pieces like this. Yeah. It's not quite expensive actually, it's quite nice. We used to do it in our vases, like for our contract vases, like put it around the collar. It's quite a lot, so you don't really need that much, so you can cut it. It is, yeah, it is like a mess. It's a very messy one, isn't it? Now what you can do is um, use a decorative wire that's a similar colour and just, if you want to sort of manipulate it a little bit, you can bind or you can keep it quite loose and natural. It's up to you. So you could do that sort of effect if you want to around it. Well, I'm actually probably going to keep it quite loose. So I'm going to put a piece of wire on the ends. Quite a strong wire, you need sort of like your sort of 90s, your 70s and 90s really. And that's going to be like in there. It might not, you have to hold it in place and then overlap it a little bit. <laughs> I mean the great thing with the better, it's quite messy and it's a lot, it gives you that natural look. I'll do that bit up in a second. Any bits that you can use again are quite good to sort of keep. Would you just grab some 90 wires, Elaine, as well? Sorry, thank you. Once it's attached, it's okay. But initially, so I'd make some hairpins with some strong wires. Long um, German pins are quite good as well, the Mossin pegs. We don't want them to show, so I'm just going to at different random places pin the Mukumbeki through into the foam just to secure it in place, really. It's a textured posy, okay? So things like the Gaelic sleeve that we've had are quite good. And I would try and do groupings as well. So you're trying to keep everything quite tight, quite dense. This is also a similar one as well that you can do. Um, yeah, and then using the flowers. Um, 
Yeah, you can incorporate some size of balls. There's another one, so size of a little bit of texture. Think about your colours. Yeah, so you can keep turning. So you've got yellow there, so I need to make sure I've got something yellow this side just to balance it a bit. The gerbils need support one because that's what makes it easy to put into the phone. Keep turning it and checking it. Even like these sort of things are quite nice for the look, to separate the little sections of. Why it's quite nice if the sides are quite loose if you can because then it brings it out a bit more. Oops. Yeah. So just keep going round, lots of different textures, different foliages. Create a shape that you a sort of tight, a di tight dome shape is what's really what you're looking for. I'm going to carry on, but it's about the same the same side as well. Mm. Yeah, so there's dishes at the back, there's bits of oasis over there. There's